welcome for me c3 students myself mr ragunath narayan chandre in department of chemistry previously we have to conduct the conductivity dilution <coughs> of mixture of weak acid and strong acid with alkali the remaining part of those experiment may be occur in case of three parts one of them is the nature of graph that is graphical representation second one the calculations and third one is here the result of this graph let us we have to start our first point nature of graph that is graphical representation of one thing first one nature of graph see we have already conducted no experiment in a laboratory <coughs> first of all we remember our observation table and the observation table we write in case of here that's like here serial numbers first then ml of alkali acid and third one observe conductance we are to say about this one n is to minus 3 one by one we remember 1 2 and so on and those we will write here last study is a 31 then second ml of alkali i first 0.00 ml then second one every time 0.5 0.5 then 1 then 1.5 and so on up to here all we have to take that is the total addition is here 15 ml okay then we have to obtain by this addition just like the stirring One by one, all the reading we have to take on, and those reading we will write here. First one, just like here, six point seven nine into here n is to minus three. See one by one, there may be decreasing order. That's like here, six point five zero into n is to minus three. Again, five point five nine into n is to minus three, and decreasing, decreasing, decreasing. And again, it will be increasing. Maybe like in case of here, that's like here, five point nine zero into ten raised to minus three. And again, maybe like in case of here, seven point seven two into ten raised to minus three. This is our observation table. By this manner, we have to just plot the nature of graph by means of here. Here, let me know about in case of this part. We have to first mention here y-axis and here x-axis. Isn't it? Here we have to first put up here. How we have to take scale particularly scale on. x axis and second on y axis and we have to write about this one that is observe conductors in the year 10 to the minus or y axis and you have to mention ml of alkali acid in We have to just take by knowing your marking. Then it 
and sounds just like it. Okay. By this way, according to our observation table, we have to just plot the nature of the without addition of alkali, that is first heading main life recommendation. Second addition, third addition, fourth addition, fifth addition, sixth, seventh and so on. Then those will be just in this first, second, third, fourth, fifth. Okay? Again those will be in this as I can. As I can. As I can. Yes, we have to remove this part here and we have to plot the nature of the graph and this. This dot we have to cover by means of circle. Okay? See how it is. Okay? Okay. Then we have to take particular scale and mark it here from this part up to here this part again by this way second part then again we have to write about this part we have to mark this situations here from equivalence to two, two lines which are come to cross to each other's marking them and take a particular marking for here x axis same about here second that is ok we have to call about them 3x we have to call about them 3y we have to obtain the equivalence point of the first graph first graph that is these situations about a strong acid we have to call that is a strong acid the second part increasing again increasing those second part we have to call that is a weak acid in presence between them we have to obtain the two equivalence point one of them for strong acid weak px one of them second for a weak acid py here we remember about these two particular points Maybe like here, this is, is equal to here 5.20 and second one is a 10.20. We know about here the x as well as the y. By these situations, we have to come in contact about the second point, and those second point is one of them that is a calculation. See about these calculations, how we have to calculate. The normality of strong acid is weak acid. By doing the equivalence point, that is first equivalence point and second equivalence point. First is the strong acid, second is the weak acid. Let me know about in those situations how those are calculate the normality of our strong acid and second one that is the weak acid. We have to use a particular formula. In case of here, first one, n1 one, one is equal to n2. By the way, we have to put up here this formula. First one, n1 one, p1 one is equal to n2 p2. We have to use this p2 as here, that is a px. Isn't it? Then we have to convert this factor, n1 one is equal to n2 into dx divided by here this p1 we know about here to calculate the normality of strong acid we have to say equals to here normality of strong acid about this situation here let me know about we have to convert again our the provided to division gate if we have to know here n2 is equal to Point two normal. Those strong alkali is given the concentration that is a point two normal. Second, Vx. Vx is equal to five point zero. We have already obtained like this ML, isn't it? And third one, P1 is equal to 
10.0 ml we have to already prepare the mixture of acid out of them the total volume of strong acid with the weak acid is a 10 ml we know about l2 px p1 put in that values in this formula then we have again calculate this n1 therefore n1 is equal to 0.2 into px 5.0 divided by here this 10 and those will be like is equal to which one here this 1.0 divided by the 10 is equal to how many here that is a 0 0.1 normal this is a normality of strong acid similarly we have to calculate the normality of weak acid and we have to utilize those formula and those will be right here in the form of say about this one say about this n1 p1 is equal to n2 p2 we have to use this p2 second equivalence point p1 then we have to subtract that's like here py minus px okay we have to put p2 as py minus px we know about the values we have to represent firstly here this therefore normality of weak acid as like here n1 is equal to n1 is equal to n2 n2 we have to write py minus px divided by p1 we remember about this one L2 is equal to already we have to supply the concentration point to normal. Then Py minus Px. Here we have to write Py is equal to 10.0 ml and Px is equal to 5.0 ml. On subtracting we have to get that is only 5 ml and P1 is equal to here 10.0 ml. We have to put all those values in the equations. Therefore, n1 is equal to n2. How many? That is a 0.2 into py 10 px 5. Total we have to write that is a 5 divided by p1 already we have to supply. That's right here. We have already prepared this is a 10 ml. We have to write about this 10 ml. Is equal to same as it is. Right here, how many? 1.0 divided by here 10 it will become that is a 0 0.1 normal this is our this is our here the normality of weak acid and how to predict the last point which is last point that is a result result the result of this cell titration of mixture of Weak acid and strong acid with alcohol are represented in each of the two ways. One of them, first one result, maybe like here, normality, normality of strong acid is equal to dash dash here, but we have to already obtain and those normality may be like here 0 0.1 normal. Isn't it? And second one. Result the normality of normality of here V S E is equal to also we have to calculate and those will be like that again one that is a point one of the normal. See about this one total experiments we have to conduct it by the simple manners. Out of them, first one just like here calibration, second like here actually titration. Third part, we have to represent here the observation table in the manner here, serial number, ml of alcohol added, and last one that is observed conductance. And by these situations, we have to just uh, conclude it to first part, that is nature of graph, then second one calculation, and third one here, results here. I want that you have to clear all the points about the second practical which are conducted on conductometry. I want that you have to stop. Okay.